Dream easily as you drift into a deep sleep with this guided meditation story. You are listening to Wanderlust, The Outer Banks, part of a series where you may journey through time and space in your custom traveling home that takes you to the most beautiful and soothing landscapes. In tonight's adventure, you find yourself venturing to the outer banks of North Carolina. You meet a friend at a roadside food stand along the way, and they join you for a night of camping on the beach beneath the stars. Wild horses gallop along the beach at sunset, resonating a deep and visceral sense of freedom. You set up a campfire and reconnect with the most beloved parts of yourself in the company of your beloved friend as you create new memories. You return to your traveling caravan and the sounds of the surf and salt air gift you a night of deep healing sleep. It's time to dream away. I would like to welcome you to Michelle's Sanctuary I am Michelle, and as you listen, you may think of my voice as that of your dear friend and trusted guide. If you have not been told today, let me remind you that you deserve to feel safe, nurtured, and to take these precious moments at the end of the day for yourself. This is your time for a mental vacation before sleep and you may use the unlimited powers of your imagination to transport you to places that enliven you and make you feel all the wonders of the human experience. This is your life and your story and the Wanderlust series is here for you to feel freedom on the open highway. As if being in a dreamscape, anything is possible. And at any point, you may let go of my voice to drift to sleep. You may customize the experience to your own needs and desires. The only guideline I bring you is that with every choice on this journey, you choose what feels good and soothes you the most. When you learn to self-soothe, this ability may never be taken away from you. Your imagination is your superpower. In the sanctuary of your room and mind, you are safe to be your most authentic self. Free of judgment, in the noise of the outside world, you go deep within. Today is behind you, and you tune into the comforts of the moment. Wiggle out any lasting impressions of the day. Sink your head into the support of your pillows. With your eyes closed, your body becomes heavy like wet sand, a wave of safe healing light washes over you like the golden rays of summer. Your breath is your vehicle in life. Inhale and feel your body expand, filling with air like a hot air balloon. Open your mouth into a big yawn and relish the freedom you have to yawn all you want. Your breath cascades out of you until your belly sinks deeply down. Dig in another deep breath until you cannot make room for another sip of oxygen. Open your mouth into one more yawn to let your body know that it is time to stand down and surrender 
to the cozy feeling of settling before sleep. You blow out the air through pursed lips and you follow your breath to a two-lane highway in rural North Carolina that weaves between lush greenery like a charcoal ribbon. You imagine you are seated in the driver's seat of your custom traveling caravan. You sit behind a wide steering wheel. Your arms are outstretched in a relaxed V-shape. Your body sinks into the soft, well-worn seat cushion. The intense afternoon summer sun causes steam to rise from the asphalt and the highway is full of leisurely travelers making the most out of the summer weather and vacation hotspots in the Carolinas. You catch a reflection in the rear view mirror and admire your aviator shades and hairstyle that reveals you have traveled in time to the 1980s. Your custom vehicle is designed to your preferences, be it an RV or a converted school bus or a Volkswagen bus. You have paid attention to the tiniest of details. And wherever you go in time and space, the comforts of home come along. Whenever you revisit your wanderlust caravan, you are met with the familiarity of a recurring dream. You feel most empowered behind the steering wheel, with your arms basking in the sunlight. When you drive your traveling caravan, your sense of freedom goes beyond feeling the freedom on the road. You feel that you are the driver and in control of your destiny. You live fully in the moment because your mind must adapt to the inevitable changes and mishaps when traveling. You have gracefully learned to laugh off the challenges and know they make for the most memorable and amazing stories. These many miles on the road have silenced your anxiety and fine-tuned your ability to go with the flow. Your two furry companions are wide awake in the center of your bed that occupies the back of your vehicle, with their eyes wide and their ears perked. They anticipate the upcoming stop along the way. You packed up your camp in the mountains at sunrise and took in the early morning hours, invigorated by the crisp mountain air. You look to the gas pedal and see your comfortable shoes and the remnants of pine needles scattered on the floor mat. The further east you drive, the more you sense the heat outdoors and the radical change from the mountain air. Up ahead you see the roadside stand where you are to meet a beloved friend who has magically traveled through both time and space to be here. The directional clicks as you turn off the highway and the tires pick up small stones from the parking lot. You see your person, someone who you have missed and wanted to reconnect with for quite some time. This person makes you feel most alive and in tune with the best parts of yourself, even when you forget. This person is here to remind you. Time is not linear in the world of wanderlust, so you may even encounter a person you have yet to meet in your waking life. It could be the ideal person that you need right now, completely imagined for this journey. As you park, you see this beloved friend through the dusty windshield of your caravan, 
dressed in 1980s summer attire. Their hair blows in the soft breeze and they place their palm as if in a salute to block their eyes from the sun. They travel with a well-worn leather satchel that hangs carelessly over their right arm. They have the same sense of adventure as you do. As they squint in the light of the sun, you meet their eyes and the connection is felt. Your heart melts, feeling the strong tie to this patiently waiting friend. You slowly drive over the crunchy gravel and park. Your pets run to the driver's seat to pounce on your legs. You leash them up and then open the driver's side door to step into the parking lot. Your pets are as excited as your person who comes to the car and wraps their arms around you in a strong embrace. You squeeze them close and as you take in a deep breath, the smell of salt air from the nearby Atlantic Ocean blends with their comforting and familiar scent. If only on a subconscious level, it awakens feelings of trust, love, and safety. The roadside stand is busy with families on vacation and locals who come for the catch of the day, fried foods, and dripping soft serve cones that don't stand a chance against the Carolina sun. The dusty outdoor seating is enlivened by the neon colors of the times that are found in vibrant patterned shirts and dresses worn by happy customers. The air is humid and smells of fried foods, engine exhausts, the ocean, and summer fun. You follow your friend to a picnic table and take a seat. Tying the leashes from your excited pets around the wooden legs of the bench. A waitress in a teal and cream striped romper comes over with a tray that contains all your favorite items ordered by your friend. You meet your friend's eyes and smile and they generously shrug as if it was no big deal. But over the deepest of loving relationships, you may have already learned that the smallest and mundane kind acts truly are the biggest deal. You finish your late day meal, satiated by the food, and soothed by the sounds of cars driving by, peals of laughter, and the soft summer winds. You rise and discard the red checkered paper boxes that once held your food and conjure memories of eating at carnivals and fairs. Your friend and pets follow you towards the edge of the parking lot to your vehicle. Your friend offers to drive and you happily toss the keys to them. These keys are deeply symbolic of your free roaming spirit. You load your furry companions into the back and then sit shotgun, wiggling down into the seat and placing your feet on the dash. It feels nice to be the passenger this time, after driving so many miles alone. The familiar sound of the sputtering engine comforts you as you open the window to take in the ocean breeze. Your friend carefully pulls onto the highway as you navigate and you catch up in a continuous flow of conversation 
while you are equally comfortable in silence. The road leads you towards bodies of water, across rivers and surrounded by bays that twinkle like beds of sapphires laid out in the lowering sun. The sun shines behind you. The golden orb is now a magenta gold hue like the embers of a fire. You guide your friend northerly and feel the cool ocean breeze blow through the opened windows. A well-known rock song of the times plays through the speakers with a lo-fi hush as soothing as the sounds of the surf. On your travels, you were told of a secret hideaway where you could camp on the beach and where wild horses run beneath the starry sky. A fellow wanderer advised you to drive past a lavender gray bungalow with a weathered hand painted sign that reads, the voice of the sea speaks to the soul. These wise words of Kate Chopin lead your friend to turn towards the dunes. They drive carefully between the rolling sandy hills that are covered in feathery pampas grass and tall, slender, mint green reeds. Your pets lift their noses towards the ceiling of your mobile caravan and fervently sniff intoxicated by the perfume of the ocean air. Your friend turns towards the north and drives on the packed sand of the vacant beach. They continue toward an inlet, finding a safe place to park beyond the reach of high tide. They turn off the engine and look at you the sparkling, mischievous eyes. Your faces explode into smiles of glee and gratitude. You softly laugh at the amazement of life and the spontaneous moments that surprise you and take your breath away. The beach is cast in a rosy glow from the sun. As it sets over the bay on the other side of the island, Your pets leap at the back door, eager to be free and to run on the sand. You exit and feel the gentle rock of the caravan, a familiar sensation that has soothed you over time. It reminds you that you have a home that can move. You open the side door and your pets hop out of the vehicle and onto the warm beach and out of routine, you take out the doormat and place it on the sand. This mat has graced the lake shores of Alaska and still carries the pine needles from your morning in the mountains. This ritual is a reminder that wherever you roam, you are welcome and at home. Your friend joins you Together, you both remove your shoes and place them on the mat. You run towards the surf with the animals and feel absolute freedom and joy. You extend your arms out as if flying to feel the misty ocean breeze against your face and body. Tiny droplets of salt water land on your lips. The gently crashing waves of low tide have created tidal pools that are like amber mirrors in the setting sun. Peachy rose streaks of sunshine break through the tufts of cotton candy clouds and reflect off the tawny, wet sand. The four of you splash through the warm tidal pools 
on your joyous run to the ocean. The sea foam is like carnation pink lace edging on the blue-green waves. Unconcerned with getting your clothing wet, you race into the waves and feel the gentle undertow that beckons you to become one with the sea. One of your pets is timider and is teased by the waves as they inch closer, causing them to skirt towards the dry sand. The braver of your pets comes swimming along. Seagulls fly overhead, their bright yellow beaks and gray streaked white wings are fully expanded and regal against the coral, peach, and periwinkle sky. Your friend is fully submerged in the water, and together you jump before the waves crash down. With your wise and resounding intuition, you make the call each time whether it is best to dive into the wave or jump and feel it crash against your backs. You inhale deeply and your lungs are relaxed in the involuntary way that comes when you use them to their utmost capacity. And you laugh. Unbridled laughter comes from appreciating the magnitude of the beauty of the outer banks. Tiny streams of salt water cascade down your face and land on your lips and you taste the briny water. The humid air captures the musky, rich salinity of the ocean. The water is as warm as bath water, but an occasional pocket of cool water offers a refreshing reprieve. You and your friend body surf towards the shore and rise out of the water just as the sun dips beyond the horizon. You hear the thunderous sounds before you see them and your pets raise their ears in curiosity. You look towards the south. The wild horses have arrived. You see them radiant and proud and splashing through the tidal pools. Their slick chestnut coats reflect the last moments of daylight. Saltwater droplets form prisms on their tails and manes as they gallop in your direction. The colonial Spanish Mustangs are known for stamina and hardiness and their ability to run long distances. The Outer Banks is their home. The pristine, untouched beach ahead is soon marked by their forceful hooves. And with reverence, you and your beloveds watch the Mustangs race along the shore. Come morning, you may awaken to the sun rising over the ocean and the horses grazing on the beach. But now they are wild and free, using their strength to launch them through the magic of twilight. The new moon is like a sliver of light oft referred to as a fingernail moon. It offers new beginnings and the promise of new adventures. The sky darkens like a navy blue cotton blanket set over the glistening blue-green waters and sand. As far as you can see, the landscape and sky that surrounds you shines you and your companion, the landscape and the sky that surrounds you, shine. You and your companion return towards your traveling home. Your pets race ahead, ready for their dinner. Your feet sink into the cool sand. 
The massage-like suction comforts your soles and arches with each step. You enter your home, customized by your travels and personal style. Your pets are so well-trained that they shake themselves off on the welcome mat before hopping into the home. Their ears perk with the sound of food bouncing in their bowls. You set down their food and grab a lighter and newspaper and two folding chairs that you bring outside. Your companion has removed the wood you collected on your morning walk, the sweet piney aroma of the logs intermingles with the salty air in a soothing elixir in the reprieve of nightfall. Together, you create a perfect beach campfire. You open up the chairs and place them close, yet far enough away to avoid the orange sparks that shoot out towards the celestial sky. Your garments dry in the light of the fire and you are entranced by the dancing flames. Your friend looks up to the sky and begins to remind you of a long-held dream you have shared with them. Friendships like this remind you of who you are when the hardships and twists in life may have caused you to forget. In this moment, with your feet nestled in the dry, cool sand, and your body relaxed and sunken into the chair. You have all that you need. Your pets join you by the fire, curling up at your feet. Your friend steps inside to prepare your favorite summer drink. And when they return, the cool tonic quenches your throat as it cascades into your stomach. Lao Tzu said, simplicity is the ultimate sophistication. Your wanderlust reminds you of this with every new adventure and every new day. The sound and smell of the ocean. The shared love with all who are with you right now. The warmth of the fire the majesty of the wild horses, the feeling of being alive and in the moment offer simplicity and make you feel rich. Time passes gracefully and you sit in silence until the flames burn down into silvery magenta embers. The night air becomes cool and your friend returns to the traveling home to clean up for sleep. Your pets, trusting and tired, follow behind. You use this time of solitude to walk out to the ocean one last time. The tidal pools have now disappeared because the tide has risen again ebbs and flows of the ocean waves remind you of your breath through this life, continuous ebb and flow of air that has carried you through a lifetime of memories. A blanket of seashells glisten along the shoreline and you pick up one that speaks to you. You think of your greatest dream the one you must fulfill before your last breath. You bring the shell to your lips and kiss it, tasting the salty water one last time. The ocean, so vast, reminds you of the grandiosity of the universe. Take the seashell and launch it far out into the ocean. 
The small splash reflects in the soft light of the new moon. And you imagine how it feels to sink down deep into the cool waters and the soft sand of the ocean floor. You are overcome with tiredness and the wonderful feeling of contentment that comes after a day of physical activity and pleasure. Every exhale comes out like a soft sigh as you walk back to your traveling caravan. The warm golden glow of the interior beckons to you, the safe haven that awaits after every new adventure. You climb into the home, proud that your friend and pets are comfortable and that you could provide this respite for everyone. It feels good to tend to their needs and to your own. Your friend is fresh and clean and their hair is still wet. Their satchel rests in your favorite cozy nook. You grab sheets and blankets and a pillow from a closet and together you change over the buffet seating of your dinette into a comfortable bed. Your companion gets cozy and reads a book while you retreat to your bathroom. You always look to the memorable stained glass windows that now look out on the dunes you turn on the shower and remove your clothes. Your sun-kissed skin is coated in salt and sand, and you step beneath the rainfall shower head as it all washes away. You shampoo your hair and lather soap on your skin, washing away the day and preparing for sleep. You step out of the shower and dry off the clean towel that you bring to your nose. It was dried in the sun atop the mountains where you last camped. Carries the fresh fragrance of mountain air. You change into lush cotton pajamas that feel soft against your skin. When you step out of the tiny bathroom, your friend is asleep with their book resting on their chest. You take away the book and save the spot before placing it on their satchel. You turn off the lights and retreat to your bed. Your animals have already made themselves cozy in the heart of the mattress. You gently nudge them as you often do and they make room for you as you peel back the quilt and sheets and climb into the bed. You keep the curtains open and peer out at the twinkling ocean, hopeful to be awoke by the first rays of morning light over the Atlantic and the promise of a new day that they bring. You look through the skylight over the bed and admire the Milky Way one last time before closing your tired eyes. Every part of your body is soft and at ease. Each breath ebbs and flows as you drift towards sleep. The sound of your pet's breathing matches the soft hush of the ocean and soon your breath matches the soporific tone as well. You are steeped in the warmth of gratitude. Floating through the sensation like a tea bag left in a lukewarm cup of tea, you surrender to the velvety richness of this moment where peace is found, where simplicity is everything. And I am going to count you down towards a night of deep 
healing sleep. Or you may drift on the waves of love and gratitude and long desired dreams, finding the answers you seek in the respite to come. Ten. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Finding bliss, finding peace, finding contentment. Finding sleep. It's time to dream away.